All right, let's, let's look at gold. And th these are uh, three sell sets that we had in gold this morning uh, with news. News came out at 8.30, non-farm payrolls. Uh, I want to concentrate on the Renko. Uh, we do so many videos on market profile and market delta over here to the right. I, I want you to concentrate on the Renko for instance uh, for, for one sec because we do so many things on the market profile on how we need to buy and sell market profile. L let's break down a price action with my Renko bar. Our Renko bar is very, very unique because it is not like any other Renko bar. Um, it has a, a filter built, has several filters built in, and the unique filter about that I like about it also is potential reversals in the market. Now, you see we have big green bars. Let me blow this up a little bit. We have big green bars for positive momentum, red bars for negative momentum. Well, what happens is, is that what happens when you just get the buyers equalizing the sellers? If we get the buyers to equalize the sellers, then what we have is we have a just a just a nice little not red not green bar it'll show up just like a flat little white line what that is that is what when the sellers are equalizing the buyers and what that can cause is a major reversal in the market and it doesn't matter what market you look at so you guys probably heard of the doji right everybody's heard of a candlestick doji that's what this Renko is trying to do, is trying to see when the buyers are equalizing the sellers and the sellers are equalizing the buyers. So if you notice what happened, we came up into major resistance up here. We had two times stack level after news. This is my high value area and this is my high value. We had green bar, green bar, green bar, green bar, green bar, green bar, and then we got a white flat line. That tells me that the buyers are equalizing the sellers. The sellers are equalizing the buyers. That's a potential reversal bar. So what we want to do then is we want to see market delta, oops, we want to see market delta give us a short at that level. So what I want to see is I want to see market delta come up right there and give us a sell signal. So when it's at that level, it gives us a sell signal. So we want to see a sell signal when market delta fires off. So you, you want to see a negative market delta, which it did right at the high. So once you see a negative market delta, then you know, with this, this had a negative market delta, this had a negative market delta, this had a negative market delta. They all had negative market deltas. So that tells me that I got a, a pause in the market with a negative market delta. That means I have a potential reversal. Now, it's three for three this morning. We've only had three of these that come up on a retest. It, it retested here. We got buyers equal to sellers, negative market delta. Then it broke down retested high value area again look at my indecision bar right there buyers equalizes the sellers then a negative red market delta caught the high again then it broke down below the control point retest then what do we get again we have the buyers equalizing the sellers sellers equalizing the buyers so then we get a negative market delta there again for a nice trade so these are all nice trades when you don't want to take these is that if you're in the middle of no man's land so if you're down here, here's one that came up down here, right there, pause the market, but it's not on a retest. You want to see a retest when you see those, break retest. Go over to uh, crude, uh, Gerald. Crude caught the high on this today with my, with my bar. If you look on crude, all right, look at crude now. Crude did the same thing. We broke below low value, right? Here's a huge trade on crude this morning. If I look at the two, two, two reversal bars, here caught the high and high value area this morning, 50.80. Then it broke below low value, retest the low value, and look at the beautiful, right there it is. Look at the buyers equalize the sellers, right? And then we had a negative market delta at the top to bring us down on a huge short. That was from 50.35 all the way down to 49.75. So that's the unique thing about this rank bar, and it caught the high this morning also. It caught the high right here it's at two of them that's come up this morning in the session crude is two for two on the reversal look at that sellers equalizes the buyers that means you got a potential reversal we have negative market delta this is what caught the ones yesterday two of the big ones yesterday we had over a thousand market delta i sent it out in your emails to you we had over a thousand market delta anything over crude over 200 is a huge major imbalance it was over a thousand guess what bar it was that bar both thousand market deltas was this bar right here. Okay, it's in 
it's a potential reversal. So make sure you guys understand that when you see that on the Rinko. When you see the Rinko uh, do one of those, then you got a potential reversal.